Hey everybody, it's Bob Murphy here. I just wanted to give you a quick update on the Krugman debate. As many of you know, I've had this long-standing challenge to Arch Kainsey and Paul Krugman to debate business cycle theory. In particular, Krugman has been advocating that governments run massive budget deficits and central banks continue to inflate as the way to solve the world's economic problems, whereas I, representing the Austrian school, think that that's the exact wrong medicine. Now the interesting twist to the debate challenge that I've given to Krugman is that I've set up a mechanism whereby the people who want to see this debate happen can pledge money. Now if Krugman debates me, the money doesn't go to me, it doesn't go to Krugman, instead it goes to a food bank in New York City. And I called them beforehand and made sure that they were okay with this and they said, yeah, we'd love to take that money. So the last I checked, the pledge total thus far is $105,000. So that's real money that people have pledged that will go to this food bank if Krugman should ever decide to debate me. So the, uh, the beauty of it is the higher that number gets, the more awkward it is for Krugman and his fans to explain why he can't be bothered. Because he's admitted on his blog, he debated Ron Paul in order to sell his own books. I'm not putting words in his mouth, that's what Krugman said. He goes on TV all the time to debate people that he thinks are economic ignoramuses in order to get his position out there. All right, so it's odd that he's refusing to debate me, especially when he's referred to me twice in print already, one time saying that my exposition of Austrian business cycle theory was the best he'd ever seen. So I encourage you to go ahead and make that pledge. Go to KrugmanDebate.com for all the details and for funny videos and things that I've done to supplement this debate challenge. And one last thing. I just want to remind you the way it works. If you enter your credit card information, you actually don't get charged unless Krugman debates me. So it's not like this third party debate uh, entity takes your money and holds it. No, no, no. You only have your credit card charged if Krugman ever decides to debate me. So if you think that it's, hey, it's a funny idea, Bob, but come on, it's never going to happen, well then there's no risk to you. Go ahead and pledge 50 bucks because the higher that total gets, the more awkward it makes Krugman and his fans. So I'm going to give a chance for this last wave to go through and then I'm going to call the food bank and let them know exactly what the total is and see if they can give a press release. So let's try to make that number as big as possible to put as much pressure on Krugman and his fans as possible. Thanks everybody. Go to KrugmanDebate.com.